Hi everyone. So this is our much awaited video of solving the paper of 2022. And uh, I I had actually so many queries. I got so many queries from the students. So I'm gonna take few queries. So uh, the first question that they asked about the working professional, and I I can tell you that how you know how you can approach this. A whole process of examination being a working professional what you can do is weekday may you can try three four hours and three four hours means three four hours should be effective hours and on weekend you can do uh, 10 to 11 hours and that should be 10 to 11 hours i know it will be it will be quite challenging because you know you might feel ki um, weekend hai mujhe sona hai ya kuch party karni hai but then you have to put that uh, 10 to 11 hours of your uh, weekend and you 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 could skip you know lunch parties and office parties for that matter so that you can do and also while traveling while traveling to the office you can just uh, see some video for example you can just you know watch Ramsar sides river ke kuch videos dekh liye as a you know while traveling you can you can just utilize that time so that is there and the second query that they have been asking so much because I also used to get that uh, uh, you know query when I started preparing that subject wise uh, PYQ karne hai ya fir uh, year wise uh, PYQ karne hai so I, I, I would tell that subject wise you can go about go with the subject wise because subject wise mein you will get, you will be in the flow for example agar aap environment ka question kar rahe ho and you got uh, you came across as a question for example of cyanobacteria so you will remember that this has been asked previously and you would remember some information about it so you can go with the flow when you are doing subject wise but also you can do when you are completed with the subject wise video uh, you know pyq analysis that you can uh, again you can do as paper wise so that you know it will be a revision for you and again it will be a it will give you the holistic picture how they are going to ask how the 2020 24 paper will be so you can also uh, go with the paper wise and also uh, i have an announcement we have launched a mentorship program which we you know will be providing a one-to-one -one mentorship program so you can go ahead and register for it because this is going to be strictly for the hundred uh, first hundred students on the first come and first serve basis will be uh, this program is completely targeted uh, about the prelims how to get through the prelims how to sail through prelims and there is a lot of other things also needed with for example current affairs logical guessing and revision that will be that would be provided in the mentorship program because it's not possible to you know free um, the course which requires so much effort and so much energy so and it is it is most affordable program in the market because it it, it only costs like around 3k so it is a most affordable program so you can uh, it's up to you if you want you can take it and we will provide the complete solution about it now uh, as 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 promised uh, we'll start with our video so we'll start with the 2022 exam question so let's jump to the question paper itself so uh, first question is about rapid financing instrument and the rapid credit facility so here uh, this question is from the from our theme which is called as imf and uh, sorry imf and uh, this is from the theme and what you need to understand here is world bank up when you solve this question so you will you will end up with the two option imf and world bank right because obviously you know that you would be uh, you would have eliminated asian development bank and unf un epfi so what you can do is you need to understand world bank and imf ka basic concept kya hai world bank is for the developmental work and imf is for the balance of payment crisis it always helps where we have a balance of payment crisis this was also in the news that yeah, you know they were trying to move Sri Lanka out of the crisis out of the debt that uh, this was in the news as well and you have to understand balance of payment crisis or any rapid payment facility is always available with the IMF we know that so here you can easily mark that IMF would be the question uh, would be the answer now um, coming to the second question so I consider myself as uh, I have a good uh, like good hold in economic subject but uh, what happened with me in the real paper was like near and read even though I have read the concept but I was not able to figure out what uh, the you know the option that they have given that what would near do what would read do so what I did I went to the third option and I read an increasing trend in domestic inflation relative to inflation in other countries is likely to cause first of all it is a it is a very you know um, very 
ஜென்ரல் ஆப்ஷன் லைக் லைக்லி டு காஸ் இட் இஸ் நாட் சேயிங் சம் மேண்டேட்டரிலி சம்திங் வில் ஹேப்பன் ஸோ லைக்லி டு காஸ் அண்ட் இன்க்ரீசிங் டைவர்ஜன்ஸ் பிட்வீன் நீர் அண்ட் இட் திஸ் குட் பி ரைட் அண்ட் தே மைட் ஹேவ் சேஞ்ச் பிட்வீன் நீர் அண்ட் ரீர் ஸோ திஸ் வுட் பி தேர் திஸ் இஸ் அகெயின் ஃப்ரம் த ப்ரொஃபஸர் லாஜிக் தட் யூ நோ த டூ ஆப்ஷன்ஸ் தே மைட் ஹேவ் சேஞ்ச் ஆர் தே மைட் ஹேவ் ஜஸ்ட் ஃப்ளிப்ட் இட் ஸோ திஸ் யூ கேன் அட்லீஸ்ட் பி ஷோர் தட் தேர்ட் ஸ்டேட்மெண்ட் இஸ் ரைட் ஐ ஹேவ் டு திங்க் அபவுட் ஒன் அண்ட் டூ இன்மே சே கோய் ஏக் சஹி ஹோகா தேட் லெவல் யூ கேன் ரீச் but saying all that i know this is a difficult question and even if you are if you if you have economics as your you know uh, potential area you have to you know mark it as that you will do it later you will fix it later and jump to the next question i mean there is no problem you don't have to take it on your ego that you know you have to solve it by that time so coming to the third question this is sorry so sorry for yeah so uh, coming to the third question here we have indian economy consider the following statement here we have uh, they are asking about the inflation they have asked many times about the inflation so here what you can do is uh, this is a this is a pure concept question and you would be knowing you know what inflation agar badhega to reserve bank kya karega inflation kam hoga to wo kya nahi karega so this uh, this can be solved with the knowledge and concept uh, i cannot teach you any trick here and now coming to this question g20 common framework so this we have we might not have heard about this right g20 common framework kya hai so what we can do is here uh, if you read the first and two statement second second statement is kind kind of lenient it is an initiative to support the low income countries with unsustainable debt because g20 is about the middle income countries it is not high fi group so this can be right but i was not sure about this because with going by the logic we have seen that organizations are generally wrong so here your trick fails and it's fine i mean the questions will be wrong and you cannot just solve 100 question otherwise cut off 200 chali jati to wo nahi hoga to questions galat bhi honge trick bhi fail honge but hame trick and knowledge maximum score karna hai right we have to we just need to clear the cut off so this this would be wrong with your logic if you want to leave you can leave or galat bhi hota to it's fine now coming to the next question i will be only discussing the questions with uh, where you can use the logic and i will not discuss the question where you will use or pure knowledge or pure you know pure uh, ratification you require so i would won't uh, you won't be discussing those questions here we have a inflation index bonds this is a uh, this you should be knowing because there has been a question regarding convertible sorry there has been a question regarding convertible bond so here you can uh, you know you would have read about different type of bond and this is a purely concept based concept based question but you can also see the third statement here it says the interest received as well as capital gains on iibs are not taxable here you should have कान खड़े हो जाने चाहिए यहाँ पे क्योंकि ऑल द बॉन्ड्स ऑल द ट्रांजेक्शन दे आर टैक्सेबल दे आर नॉट टैक्सेबल ये कभी नहीं होता है सो ह्योर इट वुड बी रॉन्ग एंड यू नो वेन यू मार्क थर्ड एज रॉन्ग यू ऑलरेडी गेट योर आंसर एज वन एंड टू सो दिस इज हाउ यू कैन डू इवन इफ यू डोंट नो अबाउट इन्फ्लेशन इंडेक्स बॉन्ड बट यू शुड बी नोइंग अबाउट द इन्फ्लेशन इंडेक्स बॉन्ड now coming to the sixth question here we have uh, they can sell their uh, what is it uh, foreign owned e-commerce uh, firms operating in india so but here what we can do is uh, here i did not know that you know they can sell their own goods in addition to offering their platform as market places so i thought that you know this would be right but i came to home and i got to know that this is wrong because uh, because we know that amazon mein amazon khud apna product sell karta hai but there was some changes in 2020 that they have a they cannot in the marketplace they can only sell the third party product so this was a change this was in the current affairs but i did not know and you you might not you know remember these kind of information so uh, i got this question wrong although i knew that the degree to which they can own big sellers on their platform is limited this was right so you know you know that this would be right because ye limited ho sakta hai of course ki bade sellers and chote sellers because there were lot of talking about you know you have to have your local component in the selling so this was there and the my government aur ye sab cheezein thi us time pe to yeah now coming to the next question we have yeah so here uh, here the logic and your common sense really works really needed actually 
uh, how it how it works is for example they are asking about the real sector ab i don't know anything how would i solve this question theek hai तो फार्मर्स हार्वेस्टिंग देयर क्रॉप्स आई डोंट नो मतलब ये कुछ प्रोडक्ट तो बना रहा है ये हो सकता है टेक्सटाइल मिल्स कन्वर्टिंग रॉ कॉटन इनटू फैब्रिक ये तो डेफिनेटली होगा बिकॉज ऑब्वियसली एक मिल जो है एक प्रोडक्ट तैयार कर रहा है दैट विल बी काउंटेड एज अ रियल सेक्टर इन एन इकोनॉमी Uh, I was confused between third and fourth option. So if you read third option, commercial bank lending money to a trading company, this I thought this could be there or could not be there because it's a lending money, so there might be a capital formation. But but we don't know, right? Right. So let's come to the fourth question. और ऑप्शंस भी ऐसे दिए हुए हैं कि वी थिंक दैट यू नो वन वन वुड बी रॉन्ग एंड थ्री माइट बी राइट और वन और टू माइट बी रॉन्ग काइंड ऑफ थिंग सो हियर अ कॉर्पोरेट बॉडी इशूइंग रूपी डिनोमिनेटेड बॉन्ड ओवरसीज राइट सो दिस ओवरसीज में वो बॉन्ड इशू कर रहा है दिस इज नॉट अ रियल सेक्टर दे आर नॉट जनरेटिंग एनी कैपिटल हेयर द कैपिटल फॉर्मेशन इज नॉट हैपनिंग सो फोर्थ इफ यू करेक्ट एज इन करेक्ट देन यू गेट योर आंसर एज वन एंड टू सो दैट्स वॉट दे आर चेकिंग दैट यू हैव दोज एलिमिनेशन स्किल्स नाउ कमिंग टू द एट्थ क्वेश्चन हेयर दिस वॉज द क्वेश्चन इन डायरेक्ट ट्रांसफर सो हेयर बाई रीडिंग विद द ऑप्शन बाई गोइंग विद द ऑप्शन यू नो दैट ए एंड बी वुड बी रॉन्ग हाउ दे वुड बी रॉन्ग ट्रांसफर्स है तो यहाँ पर गो विद द प्रोफेसर लॉजिक हेयर वी हैव सी ऑप्शन में वी हैव ट्रांसफर द फोर्थ ऑप्शन इज ट्रांसफर सो थर्ड सॉरी सी या डी में कोई ऑप्शन होगा दैट यू हैव टू फिगर आउट एंड यू हैव टू रीड एंड यू नो रीच अप टू द मोस्ट प्रोबेबल आंसर वॉट वुड बी द मोस्ट प्रोबेबल आंसर दैट यू कैन डू now coming to the ninth question here it's a yeah it's a good question it's a uh, with reference to the expenditure made by an organization or a company which of the following statement is correct a new technology acquiring is a capital expenditure this is a very general question you know that you know acquiring a new technology is always a capital expenditure so this would be right and uh, go to here go to the second option debt financing is considered as capital expenditure while equity financing is considered as a revenue expenditure so this question come relates to the uh, you might have you know uh, met across the 2020 question solar pump wala question was there ki this will be this and this will be this so this swapping this uh, two questions or two um, two terms swapping they are doing so they are making it you know deliberately wrong <laughs> they they could have just asked debt financing is a capital expenditure equity financing is a capital expenditure so they are creating it by mistakenly they are they are deliberately doing it wrong so you can think like debt financing se bhi mera ek company ko paisa ja raha hai capital financing capit that comes under capital expenditure or equity financing bhi share market mein jo wo paise laga rahe hain wo bhi mera ek capital expenditure ka part hai that is not a revenue expenditure again this comes this comes with a thorough knowledge of your economics as well because revenue mein we have a day to day expenditure and capital may be have a long term expenditure so this you can solve so like second is incorrect and first would be the answer now coming to the 10th question um here with reference to the indian economy we have a share of the household financial saving goes towards government borrowings so this is correct we know that household ka financial saving goes towards whatever we put in uh, into the bank or whatever we put into the you know uh, locker or something so this goes towards the government borrowings because this is used in the transactions and dated securities issued at market related rates in auction form a large component of internal debt so here is the the theme i would say the theme is public debt and we have a come across many articles reading about public debt even i was reading yesterday that public debt is around um, we have a public debt which is from the consolidated fund of india and we have other debt other liabilities that is uh, that comes from the public account of uh, uh, public account so coming to the 11th question uh, here what we can do is this is a this is uh, <clears throat> this question is uh, you know they are asking about some hn sanyal committee contempts of the court act 1971 so we don't know right if this was the committee that that gave this contempt of court act but uh, let's read the second option the constitution of india empowers the supreme court and high court to punish for the contempt for themselves so this we know that this is from the article 129 that you know they have this power of contempt Uh, they have this power of contempt of contempt of court now the third question the constitution of india defines so constitution of india does not define anything it just mention or you know it's where it's uh, generally they they give they give 
this kind of option as incorrect they, they, they do not define the civil contempt and the criminal contempt again so this is wrong then we'll go we'll mark third as wrong again we are left with the two options one two and one two four in india the parliament is vested with the power to make laws on contempt of court so we know right this contempt of court is this the contempt of court act 1971 so obviously the parliament would have enacted it this act so this 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 must be correct so we'll you know we'll mark one to four as an option now coming to the 12th question we have with reference to the india and consider the following here what they have given uh, first of all i'll go with the second option bar council have the power to lay down so i know that bar council this is a common sense you know for the engineering courses we have aicte who make the who make the laws for the medical courses we have indian medical council so we know that bar council of india is empowered of the education uh, duties and recognition of the law colleges so this is correct this option is correct and coming to the first option we have government law officer and legal firms are recognized as advocate but this is not this is excluded from recognition as advocate so we have seen that right that first of first statement first statement and then but and some statement cannot do or first statement but some statement cannot do this kind of combination would be incorrect and with the with the basic common sense also we know that you know we cannot say that uh, these are recognized adv advocates and these are excluded as being as uh, advocates so this would be wrong and will reach up to the answer is two only now coming to the 13th question we have a this is a constitution amendment bill so this this is uh, from the themes you should be knowing about it this is from the lakshmi kant pure lakshmi kant you should be knowing about this there is no trick over this again we have uh, the constitution of india classifies the constitution of india does not classify as a you know cabinet minister or minister of state this is a convention that we do for the simplification we we this is not defines again it or we does not it is not classified in the constitution of india we know that and uh, and you should be knowing these basic polity question polity questions mein there is no trick because you have to know and you have to have that knowledge again uh, they are asking about the lok sabha power exclusive power again this is from the they have been asking from the chapter parliament parliament is the theme under the you know 65 plus themes so you should be knowing about uh, the parliament the lok sabha and the rajya sabha you i am not discussing that question again for the anti defection law we have seen again they have they have made it specifically incorrect like you know the law specifies that a nominated legislature cannot join any political party so it can join within 6 months so that that's the timeline and again it is from the knowledge no tricks you should be applying on the polity questions here also this is a polity question i am not discussing attorney general and solicitor gen general because you know you should be knowing all this from the polity uh, knowledge and again if we come to this question mandamus writ this is also about the this is about the uh, this is from the lakshmi kant so you should be knowing here what you can do at least even if you for example i just wanted to discuss one thing that for example writs you might not remember wahan pe ki writs itne sare hain aur unke type so you might not remember what you can do is if you see 1 and 2 they are talking about this will not lie against a private organization unless it is interested with a public duty and mandamus will not lie against a company even though it may be a government company so we know this writs is all about the public official and public company this can be raised against the public official or the public company so this would be you know this would be this would lie against the government company so this could be wrong and option 1 and 2 ऑप्शन वन एंड टू आर म्यूचुअली एक्सक्लूसिव वन और टू में से कोई एक ही करेक्ट होगा वन टू एक साथ नहीं आएगा एंड उनमें से एक ही करेक्ट होगा राइट एंड पब्लिक कंपनी के अगेंस्ट ऑफ कोर्स वी कैन डू इट सो वी कैन मार्क सेकेंड एज इन करेक्ट डेफिनेटली एंड वी कैन गो विद द वन थ्री ऑप्शन ऑल दो ऑल दो यू शुड बी यू शुड बी नोइंग ऑल दिस क्वेश्चन बिकॉज दिस इज फ्रॉम डायरेक्ट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द लक्ष्मीकांत now ayushman bharat digital mission consider the following statement this this question is uh, even if you don't know ayushman bharat digital mission and you know what you can do is let's go with the option private and public hospital must adopt it here it is a you know it's it's a bar or it's a mandatory thing but you know all the all the hospitals in the india they cannot follow ayushman bharat digital mission that to a digital mission they might not follow you know primary health center and everything so you consider it 
इट टू बी नॉट ट्रू सो वन अगर हम ऑप्शन एलिमिनेट करते हैं तो वी रीच टू द ऑप्शन एज थ्री ओनली एंड थ्री को भी एक बार हम पढ़ लेते हैं इट हैज़ सीमलेस पोर्टेबिलिटी अक्रॉस द कंट्री सो दिस दिस डेफिनेटली यू नो दिस इज अ पॉजिटिव थिंग एंड फ्रॉम द पॉजिटिव पॉजिटिव ऑफ द गवर्नमेंट स्कीम सो दिस कुड बी राइट थ्री ओनली अगेन फॉर द क्वेश्चन ऑफ दिस इज अ डेप्यूटी स्पीकर लोकसभा क्वेश्चन दिस इज फ्रॉम द लक्ष्मीकांत यू शुड बी नोइंग इट फ्रॉम योर नॉलेज बेसिस तो दिस यू शुड बी एबल टू सॉल्व फ्रॉम योर नॉलेज इट शुड नॉट बी यू नो यू शुड नॉट बी अप्लाइंग एनी ट्रिक्स ओवर हियर अगेन सो विल कम टू द ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन सो कमिंग टू द ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन दिस इज वी नो दैट राइस इज यूज फॉर यू नो मिथेन एंड नाइट्रस ऑक्साइड इट ऑल्सो इट it eject all this methane and uh, upsc is always you know asks about cotton rice sugar cane so this is from the theme you will ask if what is the theme so theme was cropping pattern and uh, uh, from the cropping pattern and major crops we have been giving question about the cotton rice sugar cane wheat and we can now we can read about all this cotton rice sugar cane wheat and you know which state is producing more and which uh, in the world also we we can just know about the ranking because there has been a question right like who is the most producing like china and india was there in the option in the previous years so we can you know uh, just read about it who is uh, uh, good in the agricultural uh, ranking and uh, at least at least for the major crops that you can do now coming to the 22nd question we have a system of rice intensification so this if you just even even if you just don't know that what is rice intensification you can just <clears throat> this is a positive thing that uh, they are doing a uh, rice intensification so they are increasing the rice so and if you go with the option here we have a reduced seed requirement reduced methane produ production reduced electricity consumption all these are like positive impact that is happening because of rice intensification so obviously you will go with the you can go with the option 1 2 3 because there is no negative connotation or there is no odd options here so this is the way you should deal with the questions in the actual examination now this kind of question is actually uh, this will you know make you uh, in or out actually you you do not need to be over smart here and then if you don't need this and you don't know this kind of question just leave this question because this is again the googly question that upsc gives you in 2021 also there were many many questions and in 2022 also there were many question and again you will get this kind of question where you do not have any idea about it so just just leave this kind of this this kind of question just leave this kind of question okay now again uh, professor sahab has uh, you know told that that you can mark this option as pinar you can go with the pinar but actually what happened in the real examination i can tell you in real condition we would not be able to think ki pinar and you would not be able to link gandhi kota with the pinar uh, what we can do is so i mark this as kaveri i did not mark as market as pinar because kaveri i just thought because kaveri is the biggest river and kaveri is you know very important river and we have shishamudram falls in the kaveri river and we we heard about uh, lots of canyon is there in the kaveri so i thought it might be kaveri so you might uh, you know tick kaveri in this question but then again this will be wrong even if you are not sure about it just leave this question or if you have some idea you can do that kind of association with gandhi kota and ap वाला कनेक्शन अगर आप कर सकते हो तो यू गो विथ पेनार बट ये क्वेश्चन हो सकता है आपसे गलत भी हो जाए एंड इट्स फाइन द क्वेश्चन विल बी रॉन्ग द क्वेश्चन विल बी राइट बट यू जस्ट नीड टू मेक श्योर दैट यू गेट द सिक्सटी क्वेश्चन करेक्ट एंड थर्टी क्वेश्चन इन करेक्ट बिकॉज देर देर वुड बी सो मेनी क्वेश्चन दैट वुड बी रॉन्ग बट सिक्सटी क्वेश्चन आपको करेक्ट करने हैं टू गेट इन टू द लिस्ट दैट यू नीड टू मेक श्योर अगेन कमिंग टू द ट्वेंटी फिफ्थ क्वेश्चन वी हैव नामचा बरवा नंदा देवी नौकरे एंड namcha barwa we know that this is in <clears throat> this is in eastern side of himalayas and garhwal we call it uh, uttarakhand uh, ke side ko hum garhwal bolte hain so this is not the namcha barwa <clears throat> so this is incorrect this way you can eliminate also what you can do is and nanda devi is in kumau nokar is in meghalaya so this you should be knowing because this has been asked by upsc again and again nanda devi nokar they have asked so you should be knowing the state for this and also so this you can go with the pure knowledge not no tricks here 
and uh, here the levant yeah this is a good question levant we don't know even i i did not i have never heard of levant what is levant so what i can do is mediterranean at least go with the mediterranean subset mediterranean is a upsc's favorite they have there are many question they asked around the mediterranean now if i select option number a and option number d so what i can see is it it says region along with the eastern mediterranean shore and the entire coastal area of the mediterranean sea so entire coastal of area entire coastal would not be called as levant because you know this will require like entire you can go with that logic like entire or extreme word hote hain to entire nahi hoga but some some area along the region along the eastern mediterranean shores could be right so you can mark it as a again this is a uh this is a mapping question i am not discussing any mapping question here you know you should be knowing what because this was in news afghanistan this was in the contemporary news so uh, you would be knowing ki afghanistan ka kya border hai kara should be around karagistan tajikistan turkmenistan uh, kind of so this way you can handle this kind of question i will be only i will not be discussing the knowledge based question or i will not be discussing the um, you know very obvious questions i will just tell you what uh, tricks what logic you can use and what common sense you can use in the question paper and exactly in the real condition now this is a beautiful question monazite we know uh, we have read somewhere around about monazite and thorium and uranium when we read, uh, read about uh, uranium we read about the thorium as well so thorium uh, we are you know we are exploring the thorium yesterday i was reading about it and you know thorium mostly southeastern uh, southeast asian countries they are they are good explorer of thorium and even india we have a large source of thorium and sri lanka also has so aisa kuch information aap uh, read karte ho but then uh, how to how to solve this question in the it's actual examination so go to the third option here we have a monazite occurs naturally in the entire indian कोस्टल सैंड दिस कैन नॉट बी करेक्ट इंटायर इंडियन कोस्टल सैंड नहीं मिलेगा तो थर्ड इफ यू मार्क इट एज इनकरेक्ट इनकरेक्ट यू विल गेट द ऑप्शन एज वन टू फोर एंड इवन इफ यू वेन यू मार्क द ऑप्शन एज वन टू फोर जस्ट गो एंड रीड अबाउट इट जस्ट गो एंड रीड मोनाजाइट इज अ सोर्स ऑफ रेयर अर्थ वी नो दिस सेकेंड ऑप्शन इज मोनाजाइट कंटेन सोरियम वी ऑल्सो नो दिस मोनाजाइट सैंड कंटेन्स एंड फोर ऑप्शन इज इन इंडिया गवर्नमेंट बॉडीज ओनली कैन प्रोसेस और एक्सपोर्ट मोनाजाइट सो दिस इज हैंडल बाई बाई आई थिंक department of atomic uh, energy so da so this is uh, done by the government yeah so this can you can mark as correct now again to the uh, coming to the next question the longest day they have asked i think this is from the solstice summer solstice and winter solstice so you can easily mark the who will what will be the you know longest day or what will be the warmest day this kind of question you can handle from the basic geography knowledge again this is something um this uh, what w- uh, you can solve it uh, actually in a two way by this question this is what they are asking what they can what you can infer from this kind of question is hogera renuka rudrasagar these are the wetland wetlands ramsar wetlands they are asking so you can go about and read about the ramsar wet site uh, wetland and also uh, char hai char mein you don't know otherwise uh, also they have asked about the renuka wetland so you should be knowing you know it is in whether it is in himachal pradesh or not so here char question mein se probability hogi do ki i am a mathematician i am not a mathematician but i am an engineer so i had maths in my you know subject so four mein do ki sab do ki probability sabse zyada hogi to only two pairs so you can go with the two options that's fine again again the tricks will not work for all the 100 questions but it will work for if even if you are getting around 70 80 questions with the tricks matlab that that's way beyond you know our expectations would again for in this question we don't know about this right ki what will be the open source digital platforms i'll just elaborate here what is open source digital for example if we have a some source of code as api and here we have a source code so this code you uh, you can view this code and we can also you uh, use this code basically uh, you can use uh, this code in your api and you can make your application this is called as open source code this is a basic computer science thing but 
यू माइट नॉट नो कि ओपन सोर्स कोड इनमें से क्या हो सकता है बट वॉट यू कैन डू हियर इज फॉर एग्जाम्पल यू हैव नो इफ यू इफ यू आर सेलेक्टिंग आरोग्य सेतु यू आर नॉट सेलेक्टिंग कोविन इफ यू आर सेलेक्टिंग डिजी लॉकर वाई वुड यू लिव दीक्षा मतलब देर इज नो डिफ्रेंशिएशन ना यू कैन नॉट एलिमिनेट एनी थिंग वेन यू कैन नॉट एलिमिनेट एनी थिंग यू गो विद अ वन टू थ्री फोर ऑप्शन बिकॉज हियर यू कैन नॉट जस्ट लीव कोविन छोड़ दिया या फिर डिजी लॉकर छोड़ दिया ऑल द फोर माइट हैव द ओपन सोर्स डिजिटल प्लेटफॉर्म दे दे आर गवर्नमेंट दे आर गवर्नमेंट प्लेटफॉर्म सो दिस दिस कुड बी देयर आई मीन यू कैन नॉट जस्ट लीव वन ऑप्शन आउट ऑफ यूर राइट अगेन इफ यू गो टू द थर्टी सेकेंड क्वेश्चन हियर वी हैव वेब थ्री पॉइंट ओ वॉज इन द न्यूज एंड ऑल द थ्री ऑप्शन आर यू नो वेरी सीम्स टू बी वेरी रीजनेबल यू कैन जस्ट रीड इट एंड मार्क इट वन टू थ्री बिकॉज देर इज नथिंग दैट नथिंग नो नेगेटिव कॉनोटेशन और नो ऑड ऑप्शन आर देयर इट जस्ट अ सिंपल ऑप्शन लाइक सैज पैज अगेन वील हैव दोज क्वेश्चन आगे Again, uh, let's come to the next question, with, uh, which is with reference to the software as a service. As yeah, the same question has been here. So, uh, I I was uh, really surprised, and I I was really happy to see the computer science questions because I am from the computer science background, and I thought you know it's good that now UPSC is asking about computers and all these things. They are also incorporating those things, and you would be you know uh, knowing all this basic technology thing because yeah. so uh, here if you see uh, sas uh, they have what they have given sas bears can customize the user interface and can change so can is there Sa- sas users can do something and this 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 we have a three option so three option they might not give you incorrect if there is only one factual uh, if they have given they might give you wrong so these uh, three option seems to be very appropriate and not any you know we don't find any odd here so we can mark it as 1 2 3 and these are like basic uh, computer science knowledge they they are asking <clears throat> now come to the 34th question here in this question actually i marked it as incorrect but what you can do when you have no idea about this kind of question what you can do is so uh, they are just go with the uh, the word logic so here fractional orbital bombardment system so i was thinking like fractional orbital some it would be something like fractional so many times and then bombardment and go somewhere and then do the bombardment something like that would be there so going with the options you might eliminate a and b with your you know basic understanding ki ye nahi hoga but c or d mein you will get you will be you will you will reach by 50 50 and c and d mein you can think of you know some something a missile is put into the stable orbit around the earth and d orbit over target on the earth something like that or you would think a spacecraft moves along a comet with the same speed and places a probe on its surface you would think that you know the option might be from the c and d and again here you can go with your gut feeling or based on your logic even if you re- if you know it it's well and good but if you don't know it at least you can eliminate 50 50 now here you can use your options and you know go about it this kind of uh, question it's all about taking that gut feeling and it's all about taking that courage attempt in your actually upsc examination nothing will be you won't be sure about anything completely right so qubit is easy again you know quantum computing but here i won't tell you how to solve this but i would i would just tell you uh, you can go and read about vlc and you can go and read about wireless communication technology so these they have been asking many times communication technology again here or they are asking about the communication technology so you can just go and read about these here also you see that closed circuit television ye bol hi raha hai closed theek hai we are asking about the short range so closed bol raha hai this would be there in the option radio frequency identity this rfid i know this has been used in the toll toll mein ye use hota hai like rfid se directly payment ke liye use ho raha hai to rfid is a short range devices like bluetooth is also a short range devices so they have asked this kind of question this is again from the previous year and wireless local network we know wan jo hota hai wan is also a um, short le- short range devices we cannot eliminate anything koi bhi odd nahi hai so we can go with option 1 2 3 because these are uh, basic communication technologies that we use now again biofilms you can use this uh, you can solve this question you don't need to you know leave all these options even if you don't know what is biofilms biofilms can of course something can biofilms can form on food biofilms can exhibit antibiotic they can of course why not i mean we cannot surely show uh, you know say that biofilms cannot do something so all these are very reasonable uh, options so you can go with 1 2 3 again coming to the 
थर्टी एट क्वेश्चन हेयर वी हैव कंसिडर द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट इन रिस्पेक्ट ऑफ प्रोबायोटिक्स सो प्रोबायोटिक्स इज वी वी जस्ट जस्ट यू नो रीड द सेकेंड ऑप्शन द ऑर्गेनिज्म इन प्रोबायोटिक्स आर फाउंड इन फूड्स वी इंजेस्ट बट दे डू नॉट नेचुरली अक्कर इन अवर गट सो दिस इज द क्वेश्चन दैट वी हैव सीन इन सोलार पंप वाला क्वेश्चन इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी दैट सोलार पंप कैन डू दिस बट बट नॉट दिस तो सो दिस इज देयर एंड वी कैन वी कैन एक्चुअली यू नो सो दिस काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन दिस काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन एक्चुअली वी वी नो दैट दे आर मेकिंग इट डेलीबरेटली रोंग ओके दे आर मेकिंग इट डेलीबरेटली रोंग सो वी कैन डेफिनेटली से दैट यू नो दिस कुड बी रॉन्ग बिकॉज दे डू दे दे कैन डू दिस बट दे कैन नॉट डू दिस ये इनकरेक्ट होगा ठीक है से और एंड एंड प्रोबायोटिक्स वी नो प्रोबायोटिक्स इज अ नेचुरल थिंग वी गेट इट फ्रॉम द मिल्क और कर्ड एंड इट हेल्प्स इन डाइजेशन सो यू नो यू कैन मार्केट एज वन थ्री अगेन कमिंग टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वी हैव एंड वाई वेन वी से अबाउट यू नो सी ए पी एफ पेपर पढ़ो या सी डी एस का पेपर पढ़ो सो दिस दिस एक्चुअली क्वेश्चन वी सॉल्व फ्रॉम फ्रॉम दैट ओनली एक्चुअली आई डिड नॉट हैव टाइम मच फॉर द पी टी थ्री सिक्सटी फाइव एंड मच फॉर द न्यूज़ पेपर एज वेल सो वॉट आई डिड वेन आई वेन आई एक्चुअली सॉल्व द सी ए पी एफ पेपर आई न्यू दैट देवर देर वॉज अ क्वेश्चन अबाउट द कोविड नाइनटीन वैक्सीन सो आई वेंट एंड रीड अबाउट द वैक्सीनेशन एंड आई आई वॉज एबल टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन हाउ आई वुड आई वुड बी एबल टू सॉल्व फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू नो वन टू थ्री सही हो ना दे माइड बी समथिंग दैट दे हैव मेड इट रॉन्ग एंड हाउ यू विल गो अबाउट इट आई जस्ट टेल यू सो हियर इन दिस क्वेश्चन इफ यू सी इफ यू सी या so here in this question if you see uh, the serum institute of india produced covid 19 vaccine named covishield using mrna platform abhi i know ki agar serum institute of india ka agar ye mrna bana lega to there would be much more hype about me right uh, hype about it right to mrna technology agar humne develop kar li hoti to there would there would have been over hyped things in in india right now so mrna to nahi banaya hoga so this way i went and uh, one i made it as incorrect and then i uh, reached up the op- uh, option which is 2 and 3 so yeah and 2 and 3 was correct so this this kind of logic and your gut feeling you can go with it and also you can solve you know capf and cds paper so this way uh, you can uh, go about it again if you go to the fourth uh, and the next question if here we have a major solar storm solar flare subse uh, the the very first thing that you do is uh, what you can do is and one second guys yeah so first thing you do is it's a it's a very big um, very big question so what you can do is you know uh, first seven option may uh, five would be right right so uh, first what you can do five wale options pehle to one to pehle to apne ek card diye ye teen option mein five hai here you see seven 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 this is common six is common फाइव इज़ नॉट कॉमन सो फाइव आई नीड टू चेक अगेन वन इज़ नॉट कॉमन टू इज़ नॉट कॉमन एंड थ्री इज़ कॉमन तो फाइव वन टू में हम चेक करेंगे विल विल रीच अप टू द क्लोजर ऑप्शन यू नो वी नीड टू वी नीड टू एक्चुअली मार्क विच इज विच इज़ मोस्ट करेक्ट विच इज़ नॉट परफेक्टली करेक्ट बट विच इज़ मोस्ट करेक्ट राइट सो वन टू फाइव वन देखते हैं जी पी एस एंड नेविगेशन सिस्टम कुड विल दिस कैन हैपन डेफिनेटली दिस कैन हैपन सेकेंड ऑप्शन इज सोनामीज कुड अक्कर एट इक्विटोरियल रीजन दिस इज़ वेरी स्पेसिफिक इक्विटोरियल रीजन में ही सोनामीज आएंगी ऐसा हमें नहीं पता हो सकता राइट जी पी एस सिस्टम कुड फेल उस मतलब इन दोनों ऑप्शन में इफ़ यू वॉन्ट टू गो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू चूज वन बिटवीन दैम ऑब्वियसली यू विल गो विद वन ऑप्शन नॉट द सेकेंड ऑप्शन राइट सो आई गो विद वन द ऑप्शन विच कंटेन्स ए वन सो आई गो विद वन थ्री फोर सिक्स ऑल्सो यू कैन जस्ट चेक वेदर यू हैव टू सेलेक्ट फिफ्थ और नॉट फॉरेस्ट फायर्स को टेक प्लेस ओवर मच ऑफ द प्लानट पूरे प्लानट में फॉरेस्ट फायर हो जाएगा दिस इज लीस्ट लाइकली पॉसिबल दिस कान बी ट्रू आई मीन नॉट इन एवरी केसेज अदरवाइज यू विल चूज विद द यू नो वन ऑप्शन दिस इज मोस्ट अप्रोप्रिएट सो दिस वे यू नो यू डोंट हैव टू वेस्ट सो मच टाइम इन टू दिस when you are solving again um go to the 41 question we have climate action tracker so even if you are a computer science student you know that tracker is a database even if you are not it's fine i mean tracker you know ko something there will be a database with the lots of data and the database 
through database only you can track something right you know that the the moment i saw tracker i just marked database and you would be you know you have to be that much of atten uh, attentive in the examination and uh, all these options are not correct and you just create a database like through database you can just uh, you know track the climate action again for 42nd question this they have asked so in this question what you can do is here you have to eliminate right you can't leave this kind of question so five options are there now you again you have to find what question what options are most probable most probable right answer you have to find you cannot find ki this is correct 100 percent kisi ko nahi pata hai theek hai nahi humne ye padha hai the climate group ya ep 100 theek hai abhi apan dekhte hain ki apan isme kya kar sakte hain to isme pehli baat to panch hai to panch mein teen sahi hoga and do nahi sahi hoga to teen wale option ye dono hai let's see how how we go about it 134 and 135 so i am bothered about you know 1 4 and 2 and Five. So third option is right. Third, I'm I'm not going to read one four two five. Me. Let's see. Fourth is a some Indian companies are members of EP hundred. Some Indian companies would be there. Some hai ek probable hai. So it could be there. And fifth is the International Energy Agency is a secretary to the under two coalition. This is a fact. Is it could be UN. It could be anything. It could be UNEP. Kuch bhi ho sakta hai. This could be a fact. So with our logic, with combining all our lo logic, some I would say is right. Five may have a doubt. Hai. We don't know. Let's see the first. The climate group is an international non-profit organization that drives climate action by building large networks and run them. So this could be right. Um, I mean, there's no problem in that. So one could be right. Three, we have that this is right. And fourth is some Indian. So we can go with the option as one, three, four. Because five, we are not sure about it. Two, we have to read it. The International Energy Agency is in partnership with the Climate Group launch a global initiative EP100. So this could be some other initiative. The fact could be changed, right? Now coming to the next question, which is 43rd. Here it's a beautiful question. We know that you know uh, they, they are asking about the kidney. We we have a basic understanding that what kidney does. They 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 do the dialysis. Dialysis wala jo bhi functionality hai. Matlab usko kya kehte hain? Hindi mein chhanni jisko bolte hain. That that is done by the kidney. So yes. <clears throat> We can go with uh, with a D option that aquatic plant absorb heavy metal and excess the nutrients. So this heavy metal को छान देता है और excess nutrient को निकाल देता है. ये option you can go with this because kidney का इतना basic functionality आपको पता है कि this is used for the dialysis मतलब ये nutrients को uh, सारे अच्छे nutrients को ले लेगा and बेकार nutrients को बाहर कर देगा. The, this is how you know it works in urination as well. So this you know like this is a basic uh, science and tech understanding nine now again uh we are going uh for the 44th question here here in this question um this i still don't remember what i have marked but i and still i don't know like what um answer would be right but then uh i can tell you they they wanted to ask you about the pm 2.5 uh but they they deliberately you know put pm 10 and here you can see that pm10 can penetrate the lung barrier and enter the blood blood stream so pm10 quite be you know bigger than pm2.5 here it should be uh, pm2.5 should have been there instead of pm10 so they have again you know changed the fact here and you can eliminate the option and you can go about one four option although i am not very sure how i marked it uh, there what i marked but this approach you can follow in your uh, actual examination Now, <clears throat> Gucci, this is a beautiful question. People have not got it uh, correct, but I can tell you how you can get this kind of questions correct. So, Gucci, I have not, I have never heard of Gucci, right? I did not know. I only know the brand Gucci. So, it is a fungus. I don't know if it is a fungus or not. Let's see the second option. It grows in some Himalayan forest. So, some Himalayan forest, thoda sa, chota sa bhi kahi ug jayega. To, ye isko hum bol denge ki some Himalayan forest mein hi ugta hai, right? So now it is a commercially cultivated in the Himalayan foothills of northeastern India. But second to here say yoga, but third option may it is commercially cultivated in the Himalayan foothills. Commercially cultivated hota to me pata hota. Right, hum export import karte. We would have known ki agar ye commercially ka, jese commercially rice cultivate hota hai, wheat cultivate hota hai, sugar cane cultivate hota hai. We would have known about it, right? But we don't know. So third you can mark it as incorrect and you can go, definitely go with the option as 1 and 2. Now, coming to the 46th question we have, we are asking about some 
some polyethylene and then yeah so here uh, by looking at the options we know right that two options would be incorrect and two options would be correct i have to select now go with the options first let's see let's let's go to the option four articles made of it can be easily disposed of by incineration without causing a green, greenhouse gas we know that any incineration incineration is a basically jalana ka process koi bhi oxygen ke sath hum jala rahe hain usko hum incineration kehte hain isse gas house uh, emission greenhouse ka emission hoga that is for sure इट वॉन्ट बी लाइक कि कोई भी चीज़ आप कर लो और ग्रीन हाउस का गैस का इमोशन बिल्कुल जीरो होगा दिस दिस कान भी पॉसिबल तो फोर्थ ऑप्शन यू विल एलिमिनेट एंड अगेन नाव यू विल चेक थ्री ऑप्शन इज कॉमन नाव यू विल चेक फर्स्ट ऑप्शन इट्स फाइबर्स कैन बी ब्लेंडेड विद वूल एंड कॉटन फाइबर्स सो या इट कैन बी ब्लेंडेड आई मीन वाई नॉट दिस इज अगेन एंड यू विल चेक द सेकेंड ऑप्शन कंटेनर्स मेड ऑफ इट कैन बी यूज टू कैन बी इज देयर बट यूज टू स्टोर एनी एल्कोहलिक बेवरेज दैट कैन नॉट बी पॉसिबल आई मीन एनी एल्कोहलिक बेवरेज देयर माइड बी यू नो सम एल्कोहलिक बेवरेज दैट दे कैन यूज और सम बेवरेज दे कैन यूज इन अनदर इन अदर अदर बेवरेज सो this i think yeah so now you can mark it as 1 3 because 2 3 4 uh, we have eliminated 4 and again you know uh, this seems to be correct the first one seems seems to be correct and the third one bottle made of it can be recycled into the other products yeah definitely bottles can be recycled to made into something else again which of the following is not a bird so this is a good question mahashir they have uh, asked lot about mahashir uh, they have earlier asked about this and uh, you know earlier we had we have seen some kind of question as frog mouth uh, what is this they have asked like what is this so it the uh, the uh, correct answer was the bird so you know they have been asking such kind of question with little bit of knowledge you can mark it or with frog mouth matlab something like something look like a uh, हैन यू नो वुड बी बर्ड ये 2021 में आप सॉल्व कर सकते थे बट 2022 में गोल्डन मैशीर यू नो दैट दिस इज़ नॉट अ बर्ड दिस इज़ अ फिश सो एंड दिस यू नो दिस लिव्स इन कावेरी रिवर सो देर हैज़ बीन लॉट ऑफ न्यूज़ अराउंड इट सो यू नो दिस गोल्डन मैशीर एंड या again uh, coming to the next question this is a good question uh, this nitrogen fixing plants they have been bothered about nitrogen fixing plants a lot lately so here what you can do just use your basic bachpan ka knowledge amarnath you have seen this is like a parasitic plant we have seen it the yellow color so this won't be a nitrogen fixing plant so first thing i will do is two ko correct and correct kar do do wale option aapne kaat diye now in this option what you can do is uh, 1 3 is common 4 5 6 is not common 4 5 6 so i need to check about 4 5 6 here i can you know <coughs> i can see that uh, spinach is uh, spinach is not uh, uh, the option here is would be 1 3 not 1 3 5 6 um, and uh, spinach is a is a um, basically it's palak palak does not do the nitrogen fixation so i would go with the option is although i do not know about the clover and porcelain but i would but i can definitely eliminate spinach and amarnath so here i can get the option 1 3 4 also chickpea should be there in the option because chickpea is chana तो चना डू द नाइट्रोजन फिक्सेशन तो चिक्पी वुड बी देयर इन द ऑप्शन वन थ्री फोर वुड बी द ऑप्शन आंसर नाउ बायोरोक टेक्नोलॉजी वी हैव रेड अबाउट बायोरोक टेक्नोलॉजी दिस इज अ डैम रिस्टोरेशन ऑफ द डैमेज कोरल रिप्स दिस वाज इन द न्यूज एंड यू नो अबाउट इट लाइक द बायोरोक टेक्नोलॉजी यू कैन गेट इट फ्रॉम एनी फ्रॉम द पी टी और फ्रॉम यू नो करेंट अफेयर्स यू कैन गेट दैट दिस इज फ्रॉम दिस इज रिलेटेड टू समथिंग रिलेटेड टू द ओशन एंड डैमेज कोरल रिप्स this is a simple question again miyawaki method i i just have an idea like what is miyawaki method here in delhi we have seen so many you know urban plantation that they have done a small small plantation they look so beautiful so this is called as miyawaki method mini forest this this is just from the common sense you you cannot read this you know somewhere in the uh, uh, in the newspaper again uh, coming to the next question yeah i i would not discuss the polity basic question or the uh, or the 
history basic questions because this is purely knowledge based but what can you do even you have you don't know in depth about this government of india act 1919 so jo uh, actually maine wahan pe dimag lagaya tha i'll tell you that ki which of the following were treated as a reserved subject reserved subject to reserved wo hoga na jo important hoga jaise revenue hai police hai and local self government is always neglected even in the today scenario we have seen that local self government is neglected we do not have fund or anything to local सेल्फ गवर्नमेंट आप काट दो आपने टू काटा आपका ऑलरेडी आंसर आ गया वन थ्री फोर एंड वन थ्री फोर इज करेक्ट एंड दिस इज हाउ आई गॉट इट करेक्ट सो दिस इज द अप्रोच यू शुड डू यू नो विद योर नॉलेज विद योर बेसिक कॉमन सेंस यू कैन गेट इट फनम कॉइन्स नाउ इन द रिसेंट वीडियोज वी हैव बिन टेलिंग दैट यू नो फनम वी कैन गो विद द इकोनॉमिक टर्म्स लाइक कॉइन बट आई वुड सजेस्ट यू नो दिस यू माइट नॉट गेट इन द क्वेश्चन इन द इन द एक्चुअल एग्जामिनेशन फनम यू यू शुड बी लीविंग दिस कैंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन आई लेफ्ट दिस क्वेश्चन एंड यू कैन नॉट जस्ट मार्क इट रैंडमली एनी थिंग बट बट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू गो यू कैन गो विद द इकोनॉमिक टर्म्स एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट टू लिव लीव बेस्ड ऑन योर नंबर ऑफ क्वेश्चन दैट यू हैव अटेम्प्टेड यू कैन लीव एज वेल ओके दिस इज अगेन हिस्ट्री क्वेश्चन आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट इट अगेन क्रिप्स मिशन इज अगेन फ्रॉम द थीम्स दे हैव बीन आस्किंग लॉट ऑफ क्वेश्चन अबाउट क्रिप्स मिशन यू शुड बी रीडिंग अबाउट इट अगेन या दिस इज द क्वेश्चन दैट यू माइट नॉट हैव हर्ड ऑल दो यू नो अवादाना दे हैव दे हैव आज डिड बिफोर दिस इज काइंड ऑफ बुद्धिस्ट टेक्स्ट इज देयर बट वी वी जस्ट नो अबाउट बुद्धिस्ट टेक्स्ट है ये समथिंग जैन टेक्स्ट है वी डोंट नो अबाउट ऑल दिस राइट सो वॉट वी कैन डू बेस्ड ऑन you know my logic being an engineer i can just say ki four se four uh, options hain to wahan pe two options ki probability hone ki sahi hogi to go with the second option two four and other options does not contain two options right to so go with the two options two four we don't know what is going to be right but at least ye gut feeling ye courage leke aana padega in the examination again coming to the next question we have yes this is all of also from the history but you know we have read something nath muni's from vaishnava scholar or we we uh, you should be having some idea about all this although i did not have any idea about this but uh, what i can do what how much i can eliminate is you know none of the pair and all the three pair correction hone ke might be chances there will be less chances of it so i can do is only one pair or only two pair i can go with you know three ka average ya half kitna hoga 1.5 so i can go with only one pair or only two pair something like this i will mark in the actual examination or if if i don't have any idea if you have idea about all this then then go with the knowledge again um, yeah this is a good question actually i am very scared of the history questions but what at least what till what time you can eliminate is the first mongol invasion of the india happened during the reign of jalaluddin khalji to so at least aapko ye pata hai mongol invasion 700 se something start ho gaye the तो ये जलालुद्दीन खिलजी का टाइम बहुत बाद आया था राइट ये दिल्ली सल्तनत में भी कोई एक डायनेस्टी है तो मंगोल इन्वेजन हो सकता है बहुत सारे उससे पहले हुए होंगे जरूरी नहीं है कि इट इज एट द टाइम ऑफ जलालुद्दीन खिलजी हो सकता है इसकी जगह अलालुद्दीन खिलजी हो जाए कुछ भी हो जाए तो ये एटलीस्ट हम इनकरेक्ट कर सकते हो कि यार मंगोल इन्वेजन बहुत पहले से स्टार्ट हो गए थे और खिलजी डायनेस्टी बहुत बाद आई थी डेली सल्टनेट में तो दिस यू एटलीस्ट यू कैन मार्क इट एज इनकरेक्ट वन टू को हटा दो तो टू ओनली थ्री ओनली में हियर यू कैन गो विथ योर गट और मे बी नॉलेज बेसिस इसमें आपको टिक कर सकते हो ठीक है अगेन कम टू द क्वेश्चन एज कम टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर फिफ्टी एट हियर दिस इज यू नो कुल्हा दरन यू कैन नॉट सॉल्व दिस काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन एट ऑल एंड यू डोंट नो यू हैव नो आइडिया अबाउट इट जस्ट लीव दिस क्वेश्चन यू डोंट यू डोंट नीड टू पुट एनी एफर्ट हियर जस्ट मार्क दिस क्वेश्चन एंड दिस विल कम दिस ट्रिक्स एंड दिस यू नो गट फीलिंग विल कम वेन यू सॉल्व लॉट ऑफ पी वाई की क्वेश्चन देन ओनली यू विल फील दैट काइंड ऑफ कॉन्फिडेंस इन द पेपर now this is a question yeah so this uh, i'll just explain one option here the the third option says the english uh, english east india company established a factory at madras on a plot of land leased from representative of the vijayanagar empire so vijayanagar empire was around around 1400 something and you know eic came at uh, 1600 so you can and they are asking they are telling ki representative of the vijayanagar empire se inhone kuch liya hoga to ye it it could be it could be 
करेक्ट बिकॉज रिप्रेजेंटेटिव ऑफ दैट विजयनगर एम्पायर दिस कुड बी करेक्ट एंड अगेन बाय अदर अदर क्वेश्चन अदर ऑप्शन यू कैन यू नो रीड एंड यू कैन गो विद योर नॉलेज इफ यू फाइंड इट करेक्ट सो ऐसा कुछ अपन जुगाड़ लगा सकते हैं पेपर में दैट वे यू कैन एटलीस्ट एली एटलीस्ट थिंक कि थर्ड तो सही है थर्ड वाले ऑप्शन तो मैं सही करूँगा देन यू कैन गो अबाउट विद द एक्चुअल फाइंडिंग एक्चुअल आंसर अगेन कॉटेलिया अर्थशास्त्र तो हियर इफ यू वेन वेन यू रीड दिस ऑप्शन इन द इन एक्चुअल एग्जामिनेशन वॉट यू वॉट यू वॉट यू डू इज वॉट यू कैन डू इज यू नो दीज ऑप्शन आर दीज ऑप्शन आर यू नो दीज ऑप्शन आर वेरी रीजनेबल ऑप्शन वेरी लीनियंट यू नो दिस कुड भी देयर इन द कॉटेलिया अर्थशास्त्र कोई भी एक ऐसा ऑप्शन नहीं है जो आप एलिमिनेट कर सको यू नो दिस कुड भी राइट दिस कुड भी राइट दिस कुड भी राइट गो विद द वन टू थ्री ऑप्शन आई मीन देर इज नथिंग एज नथिंग कॉल्ड एज यू नो वेरी वेरी इनकरेक्ट ऑप्शन कुछ ऐसा लग नहीं रहा है देख के नाउ कम टू द सिक्सटी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन वी हैव here this is from the theme uh, it's about external commercial borrowing it it should be you should be reading about this this is from the concept economics basics so you should be knowing about this external commercial uh, borrowing this is there is no logic first you have to go with the knowledge and then you have to go with the logic or some intelligent guessing but first you should go with the knowledge first here uh, this question i actually i don't know how i got it correct but because i was uh, Uh, I think the option for this correct is all four state, not only three state. But uh, I got it incorrect. How how I did it was uh, like you know I was sure about Kerala, Tripura. They are asking about the tea producing state. So I was sure about the Andhra Pradesh, Kerala and Tripura. But Himachal Pradesh I was not very sure. Although it is a hilly region, there should be a tea or anything. But then I was not sure about it. So I marked it as only three. But I think the option is all four states. I'm not very sure about it. I'll just confirm this. In in the comment section, but yeah, you can also go with the you know this is a basic knowledge that you should be knowing. That's how you 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 should be reading about the cropping patterns. You know, tea kahan kahan pe ukta hai, coffee kahan kahan pe hota hai, cotton kahan kahan pe hota hai. You should be having this basic idea. Again, uh, this is a good question. I'll I I would not discuss economic questions, but I I want to discuss this question because uh, you know first go with the first option. In India, credit rating agencies are regulated by the Reserve Bank of India. so here we know ki uh, credit rating agency meeting on uh, credit rating agencies are moody's moody's hote hain ye deloitte hota hai ye credit rating agencies hote hain right to so ye this cannot be controlled or regulated by rbi right kyunki credit rating agencies are independent body sabhi to wo kisi ko rate kar payenge independently to so this i know that this is incorrect completely incorrect now if you, if we eliminate 1 1 1 so i get the option and also even if you are not sure for example if you if you tell me ki brickwork rating is an indian rating credit rating agency we don't know brickwork rating is an indian credit rating agency right but then we know we are for sure ki first option to galat hi hai ye kya pata ho kya pata na ho we don't know so go with us two three because first is definitely incorrect right again uh, we have a bank board bureau uh, this is from the previous year and you should be knowing about the bank board bureau this was in the news this is purely conceptual and you should be knowing about it again the convertible bonds this is from the economics uh, you know do read about bonds you would be able to solve all this question again this is a good question again they have been asking they have asked about aiib so you know you should be reading about because in th- this was in the previous year so you should be reading about aiib mtcr was in the news and sco uh, you know they have asked such kind of question whether india is a part of this particular organization sco or some you know some organization they have been asking about this so you should be knowing this question This is a good question. Now we know that here we need to eliminate some of the option because we don't have one, two, three, four, five, and one, two, three, four, five. You know, getting all five correct uh, options are not. You know, it's it's less likely to be possible. So what we can do here is, you know, we will just eliminate. So first thing. फाइव है तो तीन सही होंगे ठीक है अब फाइव है तो तीन सही होंगे लेट सी तीन वाला ऑप्शन तो वन थ्री फोर है लेट सी वन थ्री फोर में क्या बोल रहा है वियटनाम हैज बीन वन ऑफ द फास्टेस्ट ग्रोइंग इकोनॉमीज इन द वर्ल्ड इन रीसेंट इयर्स वी नो लाइक या दिस इज वन ऑफ द फास्टेस्ट ग्रोइंग वन ऑफ द बोला है तो वन ऑफ द इज अ वेरी लीनियंट स्टेटमेंट एज वेल सम ऑफ द 
या फिर वन ऑफ द ये बहुत ही लीनियंट स्टेटमेंट है ठीक है तो वी कैन वी कैन मार्क इट एज राइट ठीक है थर्ड ऑप्शन अगर हम कहें वियतनाम इकोनॉमिक ग्रोथ इज लिंक टू इंटीग्रेशन विद ग्लोबल सप्लाई चेन सो वी नो दैट ऑल साउथ ईस्टर्न साउथ ईस्ट एशियन कंट्रीज लाइक फॉर एग्जाम्पल बांग्लादेश ऑल्सो दे हैव बिन रैपिडली यू नो एक्सपोर्टिंग एंड दे आर इन द ग्लोबल सप्लाई चेन दे आर अ पार्ट ऑफ ग्लोबल सप्लाई चेन इवन दे हैव अ बेटर एक्सपोर्ट यू नो दैन इंडिया इन सम टेक्सटाइल सेक्टर सो वी नो दैट दिस इज ट्रू फॉर द साउथ ईस्टर्न कंट्रीज साउथ ईस्ट एशियन कंट्रीज नाउ फॉर द सेकेंड ऑप्शन सो वन थ्री एंड फिफ्थ ऑप्शन वियतनाम हैज द मोस्ट प्रोडक्टिव ई सर्विस सेक्टर इन द इंडो पैसेफिक रीजन एंड दिस कुड बी करेक्ट नाउ फोर्थ ऑप्शन इज फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम वियतनाम्स लो लेबर कोस्ट कॉस्ट एंड स्टेबल एक्सचेंज रेट हैव अट्रैक्टेड द ग्लोबल मैनुफैक्चर तो फोर्थ ऑप्शन इज करेक्ट वन वन थ्री फोर वी हैव मार्क बट अगेन हाउ यू विल गो अबाउट द हाउ विल यू चेक अबाउट द रॉन्ग ऑप्शन वियतनाम इज लेड बाई द मल्टी पार्टी सिस्टम दिस कुड भी रॉन्ग ना मल्टी पार्टी की जगह हो सकता है सिर्फ टू पार्टी हो या हो सकता है मोनार्की हो या हो सकता है कुछ और पार्टी पॉलिटिक्स सिस्टम हो दिस दिस इज अ फैक्चुअल सो दिस कुड बी रॉन्ग तो यहाँ पर सेकंड गलत होगा और वन थ्री फोर वी कैन मार्क इट एज करेक्ट नाउ वी हैव अ सिक्सटी एट क्वेश्चन इन इंडिया विच वन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर मेंटेन प्राइस स्टेबिलिटी वी नो द कंट्रोलिंग इन्फ्लेशन दिस इज डन बाई आर एंड रिजर्व बैंक ऑफ इंडिया रिजर्व बैंक ऑफ इंडिया दिस इज देयर सो यू नो कंट्रोलिंग इन्फ्लेशन वी डेफिनेटली विल गो विद द रिजर्व बैंक ऑफ इंडिया नाउ दिस यू यू वुड नो लाइक दिस इज अ वेरी बेसिक क्वेश्चन नाउ विथ रेफरेंस टू द एन एफ टीज कंसिडर द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट्स विथ एन एफ टीज नाउ वॉट वॉट वी वॉट वी कैन डू इज सो आई डिड नॉट नो अबाउट एन एफ टीज एंड वन ऑफ माई फ्रेंड यू नो टोल्ड मी दैट वॉट इज एन एफ टी सो इट्स अ पिक्टो पिक्टोग्राफिक सम टोकन दैट दे यूज एंड दे सेल इट ऑक्शन you know auction wise in the commercial marketplace so uh, for example i just had some idea like nft kya hota hai but then you know if you look at the option number 3 they can be traded or exchange at equivalency and therefore can be used as a medium of commercial transaction here commercial transaction right now we can't use it as a commercial transaction have you seen your parents going and you know buying something from the nft to basic knowledge bhi use karna hai basic common sense bhi use karna hai nft se abhi hum nahi khareed sakte maybe in future we could be able to buy from cryptocurrency or nft but for now one two would be correct because one two it's a, it's a digital representation of a physical asset and they are unique cryptographic tokens that exist on a blockchain right so third option is incorrect we can't do the commercial transaction as As of now, as of now, we can't be using as a money. Now coming to the next question, we have a uh, Ghat Prabha Gandhi Sagar, Indra Sagar. I I just knew about Gandhi Sagar and I got confused Indra Sagar because Indra Sagar is there in the Madhya Pradesh as well. So I think it's in Chambal River. Uh, and uh, i i i did not know uh, but uh, but what what you can do you should be you should be reading about the dams major dams in india and what i did here what i did was you know 4 ki probability 2 hogi to i i i marked it incorrect the right option is only three pairs but then you know some questions would be incorrect with your logic and everything when you don't know you have to take that chance in the paper but some would be would be correct so it's fine you know if something is uh, something you are getting is in correct and also you have to see like they are asking about what is not not correctly matched so they are not asking about what is correctly matched and uh, coming to the next question we have like we have a question like in india which one of the following compiles information this is a good question we or we always you know this is a basic question when we talk about like cpi and wpi so we have a table we read about it in the economics and cpi iw kon nikalta hai ir kon nikalta hai rural wale workers kon nikalta hai uh, we we know this that you know this is from the labor bureau and uh, when you read about cpi just you know go through with the basics and uh, read about the differences uh, between them and the type of cpi that they that, that they take out so here we can just see that workers it is talking about the workers and labor लेबर के बारे में बात कर रहा है तो दिस विल बी लेबर ब्यूरो राइट बिकॉज दिस इज द मोस्ट अप्रोप्रिएट क्वेश्चन यू माइट गेट कंफ्यूज बिटवीन द ए सी एस ओ एंड लेबर ब्यूरो बट लेबर ब्यूरो सीम्स टू बी मोस्ट अप्रोप्रिएट ऑप्शन एंड दिस दिस एनी वे यू वुड बी रीडिंग इन वेन यू रीड अबाउट द सी पी आई सो यू वुड बी रीडिंग इन द basics static when you read now coming to this question a cco i have never heard of this kind of question so this is the kind of question that you know this video is all about that when you don't know the question or answer how you will 
how will you solve these kind of questions so cco cco i don't know something it looks like coal controller something ye kuch lag raha hai ki public public started government of india ka koi body hai now uh if i re- if i read all the options cco is the major source of coal statics in government of india it monitors progress of development could be could be captive coal or lignite block ka kar sakta hai cco could be the government of india ka ye kar sakta hai it hears any objection to the government's notification relating to acquisition ye bhi kar sakta hai but the fourth coming to the fourth option here they say is that you know it ensures that coal mining companies deliver the coal to end user in the prescribed time so uh, the the controller controller cannot ensure the delivery and that to a एंड यूजर ये एंड यूजर मतलब कोई प्राइवेट कंपनी अगर कोल खरीद रही है तो उसका डिलीवरी का इंश्योरेंस ये नहीं दे सकता राइट ये इट्स अ कंट्रोलर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन कुछ इन सब में कैप्टिव कोल और लिग्नाइट ब्लॉक कोल को कर सकता है बिकॉज इट्स अ गवर्नमेंट बॉडी सो इट कैन नॉट डू दैट डिलीवरी टू द कोल टू द एंड यूजर दिस पे दिस पे आई मार्गरेट एज इन करेक्ट एंड आई रीच अप टू द वन टू थ्री बिकॉज यू नो थर्ड आई आई I thought that third uh, option is also correct. It hears any objection to the government's notification relating to the acquisition of the coal bearing areas. Now, what you can do is you can just go and read about this. And even we have seen this question for the first time in the in the examination, so we did not even know about CCO. Now, this is a this is a easy question. This is from Basic Lakshmi Ka that fifth schedule. So they have been question about fifth schedule and sixth schedule. You should be knowing about the basics of it. Why they have been a categorization and what fifth schedule areas can do. What sixth schedule have the power. So this is a basic, and you should be knowing about this. Again, coming to the seventy fourth question. Here, I did not have any idea about this India Sanitation Coalition. What is this platform? But what I can do is. so going to the second option i saw the national institute of urban affairs is an apex body so this i have heard like you know national institute of urban affairs ye ho sakta hai ki ministry of housing and urban affairs ka body hoga this might be correct but when you go to the first question here it says india sanitation coalition coalition is a platform to promote sustainable sanitation and is funded by the government of india and world health organization so yahan pe we have seen that organizations are generally wrong ministry is generally wrong right so organization mein yahan who ki jagah ho sakta hai wb ho हो सकता है वर्ल्ड बैंक हो हो सकता है यूएनडीपी हो कुछ भी हो सकता है राइट तो ऑर्गेनाइजेशन कुड दे 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 कुड हैव मेड इट रॉन्ग सो आई आई एल अज्यूम दिस टू बी इनकरेक्ट एंड आई एल टेक सेकंड एज करेक्ट एंड आई विल रीच अप टू द ऑप्शन एज ओन टू ओनली now coming to the 75th question this is again exactly from the pyq the way i have explained previously that the question they are they are creating a new question from the pyq so central ground water authority they have they have given this as an option that this is the body has been found under the epa so this you should be not correcting correct ye ek ek second mein hona chahiye wahan par question now un uh, un credential committee i did not have any idea about this un credential committee now let's go with the options how how we can do it it is a committee set up by the un security council and works under its supervision so i don't know un security council ke andar bhi ho sakta hai un ga ke andar bhi ho sakta hai let's see let's see and then it traditionally meets march june and september here you should be you know you should be very attentive it could be march it could be april it could be december it could be anything it could be it could be you know the first month of the uh, of the year or financial year anything it could be march june september ka sahi hona is is highly impossible right so second i'll i'll mark it as incorrect so i'll left with the 3 and 1 3 option matlab 3 mujhe nahi padhna hai i'll you know check first so now here you you have Have reached up to fifty fifty. Here you can go with your with your personal assessment whether you'll go with the third option or one three option. What you feel like? I went with the one three option because. uh one three option because uh, you know it's a united nation credential committee could be a un security council you can you can select anything between this but 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 our goal is at least to reach up to 50 50 and you know then you mark it on the basis of your gut feeling and that will come uh, when you solve many papers so that will come with you uh, trust me now this is a very good question this is they are asking about the polar code so i you you know you should be getting this question as correct because what happens is now if you just read the option even i have not heard of polar code now if you just read the options you will you will easily you know eliminate b and c 
because this is they are talking about some only only for the north pole and this is not seems to be relevant so b and c you will eliminate now you will be left with a option or the d option now uh, what i thought between choosing a to t what i thought if it is a trade and security agreement of the member countries of the arctic council then we would have been known we have been preparing from two to three years for upsc so we, we would have been come come across such kind of you know thing trade and security agreement for the arctic council we don't know there is a arctic circle uh, uh, there's a arctic council but we have not known about this right so this might not be true if it is a security agreement we would have known now if i go to the first option it is an international code so code code is code there so code uh, word association again the professor logic is there that you know word association we have to do code is code of safety for ships operating in polar so first you have got ki code se code ho sakta hai aur ye ho sakta hai ki international code hoga for safety for ships operating in the polar waters jaise humne normally padha hai code of conduct code of business hamare office mein hota hai you know uh, code of ethics to ek ek normal code ya protocol ho sakta hai definitely and this is actually how how got it correct we don't know but we we would be able to solve the question now un general uh, un general assembly so this kind of question uh, this is a question that you read so you know you see that un general assembly all the all the three options are uh, seems to be very reasonable seems to be very uh, there is no you know negative or there is no uh, odd options here uh, un general assembly can grant observer states definitely it can to the non member states who does, who does not have the observer state again intergovernmental organization definitely intergovernmental organization and uh, uh, even ngos they they can be a part of uh, un general assembly that is that is why we call it as a general assembly and permanent observer in the un general assembly can maintain missions at the un headquarters this seems to be very reasonable statement very very probable statement there is nothing like ki aapke yahan pe kaan khade ho jaye ye teen sahi options hai you can go with go with 1 2 3 now coming to the yeah this is a very good question i wanted to discuss they are now asking like tea board tobacco board this kind of question they are asking so what you can do is ab yahan pe with the options now you have to eliminate two options do option to eliminate karne padenge because answer mein hi nahi hai so what you can do is first first we'll see ki yahan par third or fourth options dekhte hain third fourth mein the tea board head office is situated in bangalore to so bangalore could be kolkata or kolkata could be delhi anything could be there and i think the right uh, right option is kolkata only the t board so uh, this is a fact fact this can be they, they can made it wrong the fourth option if you come to the fourth option you will say the board has overseas offices at dubai and moscow so yahan par do option hai do option ko galat karna is less likely you know and one option one fact ko galat karna is more likely to ab isko galat kar do third ko galat kar do aap eliminate kar do ठीक है अगेन टू फोर वन फोर में हम देखते हैं द टी बोर्ड इज स्टैटरी बॉडी दिस कुड भी राइट क्योंकि स्टैटरी बॉडी कोई बोर्ड बना है तो कहीं कहीं स्टैट्यूट से आया होगा ना कहीं लॉ से आया होगा तो दिस कुड भी राइट देर इज नो प्रॉब्लम इन दैट अगेन हाउ यू विल मेक टू रॉन्ग इट इज अ रेगुलेटरी बॉडी अटैच टू द मिनिस्ट्री ऑफ एग्रीकल्चर तो मिनिस्ट्री हमारे हमेशा गलत होता है ये दूसरे मिनिस्ट्री में है आई थिंक और ये मिनिस्ट्री गलत होता है वैसे भी आप जा सकते हो ऑप्शन टू से भी स्टार्टिंग में जाके भी आप टू को टू वाले को गलत कर सकते हो और यू कैन गो स्टार्ट विद द थर्ड ऑप्शन तो this is how you have to you know uh, practice the pyqs and also in the actual paper you have to implement you have to have that courage that you will you you are going in the right direction now green washing is there so green washing ka question hai here i just knew that you know green washing ye this is something they give the false impression of uh, they do the eco friendly thing but they are not eco friendly enough so this uh, this this i just knew about it and you can actually you know go with the option ki green washing mein kya hoga they must be hiding something and they are showing something else something like that so you can solve this question otherwise you know just leave this question for the uh, for the last baki ke jo uh, end ke 10 15 minutes hain usme aap thoda soch ke dimag laga ke isme kuch kar sakte ho aap right now for the next question now for the next question 81 yeah so here yeah it's a beautiful question uh, here i did not know about what high cloud does what low cloud does so here it is a it is a you know they have swapped this if you just see the high cloud and low cloud so uh, ye dono in dono ne swap kiya hua hai ab ye aap bologe ki ye kaise pata chalega hame kaise dimag mein aayega to uh, have you seen that zamindari and jagirdari question previous year 
ये दोनों को इन्होंने स्वैप किया हुआ था ठीक है अब हमें नहीं पता तो ये यू करती है ये दोनों को गलत बनाने के लिए स्वैप कर देती है तो यहाँ ये वाली प्रैक्टिस से आपको ये समझ में आएगा कि हाई हाई क्लाउड और लो क्लाउड को इन्होंने स्वैप किया होगा राइट तो ये इससे आप नीदर और नीदर और नॉर्थ टू मार्क कर सकते हैं बिकॉज यू कांट रिमेंबर सच फैक्ट्स एंड यू माइट नॉट इवन इफ यू रेड इट यू माइट नॉट रिकॉल इन द एक्चुअल एग्जामिनेशन ओके सो दिस यू कैन डू एटी Now coming to the 82 question. question. This is also good question. I am not generally discussing the map based question, but what you what you can do is what you can do is here. Um, um, what you can do here is uh, see some people, some people. So this might be correct. And if you go with the first option here, it says B D B D is a large refugee settlement in north west. In north western. In north western. बी डी बी डी इज़ लार्ज रेफ्यूजी सेटलमेंट इन द नॉर्थ वेस्टर्न केन्या सो आई एम सो सॉरी गाइज फॉर दॉल्ड आई एक्चुअली हैव अ ऑफिस टूडे सो या जस्ट गिव मी अ सेकेंड या सो बी डी बी डी इज़ अ बी डी बी डी इज़ अ लार्ज रेफ्यूजी सेटलमेंट इन द नॉर्थ वेस्टर्न केन्या सो हियर दे हैव गिवेन अ वेरी स्पेसिफिक नॉर्थ वेस्टर्न केन्या इट कुड भी नॉर्थ ईस्टर्न केन्या और इट कुड भी यू नो साउथ केन्या एनी थिंग कुड भी देयर सो यहाँ पर बहुत ही स्पेसिफिक लोकेशन दिया है ये दिस कुड भी रॉन्ग राइट सो और यहाँ पर सम है सम है तो वी कैन गो वी कैन ईजली गो विद द ऑप्शन टू थ्री सो टू थ्री कुड भी कुड भी कुड भी राइट एंड यू नो यू कैन एलिमिनेट द फर्स्ट वन here uh, i am not i am not uh, discussing the mapping question but you can you know turkish state we can go something like azerbaijan could be there aise karke aap ja sakte ho to option tak aap pahunch sakte ho now coming to the 84th question here gujarat has the yeah this is uh, uh, you know uh, <clears throat> this all three questions are fact uh, one second guys Gujarat has the largest solar park in India so this is also a fact Kerala has a fully solar powered international airport Goa has the largest floating solar photovoltaic project so i did not know about all this but at least i what i thought is Gujarat mein largest solar park nahi hoga this could be somewhere in the Rajasthan kyunki maybe wahan sunlight zyada hai aisa kuch bhi logic mein laga rahi thi to Gujarat could be nahi hoga aur some i have a friend from Kochi he told me you know fully solar powered plant uh, so fully solar powered international airport is there in the Kochi Kochi bahut famous bhi hai to this is correct so i'll go with the two only because mujhe laga ye fact hai and ye bhi unhone kuch change kiya hoga i did not have idea about it but this is how i went about it and two only is the correct option here to uh, yeah the next question is un clause so un clause un clause is un clause you can you can um, you know uh, this is you cannot you cannot say here ki 12 nautical miles is a fact 200 nautical miles because this is this is a basic you know basic uh, the basic thing that if you have been preparing for upsc you would know about un clause and ye basically aisa hota 12 12 and territorial waters and then exclusive economic zone up to 200 uh, nautical miles so you would be knowing about this and this is correct exclusive economic zone shall not extend extend beyond 200 nautical miles from the baseline this is a correct option this is also correct option 12 nautical miles and if you go with the second option ship of all state whether coastal or land long enjoy the right of innocent passage innocent passage is there and this is uh, this is mentioned in the un clause so this is this is pure knowledge and you 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 would know about it right again coming to the next question which one of the following statement best reflect the issue with senkaku island i just had the rough idea about senkaku island ye somewhere it is between china and japan and we know ki china japan ek hi option mein hai so we can we can mark it and also like this is some dispute going on between the east china in the east china sea so this is like easy question even if you don't have mapping idea very very finely but 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 you can you can mark it and uh, the next next option is chad gunia lebanon tunisia now i don't know about it, about all this and i did not get so much you know i did not get so much time about reading newspaper or going with the pt 365 i did not know about this what you can do the basic 
यू नो बेसिक फंडा ये होता है इंजीनियर का कि चार है तो चार में दो प्रॉबिलिटी सही होगी जस्ट मार्केट इज एज ओनली टू पेयर यू डोंट नो बट यू हैव टू टेक दैट रिस्क और हो सकता है नाइन्टी अगर आपके आप नाइन्टी परसेंट क्वेश्चन या एट्टी परसेंट क्वेश्चन ऐसे लॉजिक से सही हो रहे हैं देन यू आर गुड टू गो राइट देर इज नो प्रॉब्लम अगेन अगेन द सेम मैपिंग क्वेश्चन आई डिड नॉट नो अबाउट इट आई थिंक कैटेलोनिया कुछ स्पेन में है कुछ ये इन्होंने स्वैप किया होगा तो चार में वही सेम दो होने की प्रॉबिलिटी या दो को उन्होंने स्वैप किया होगा और दो को सही दिया होगा तो अगेन आई वेंट विद द ओनली टू पेयर एंड दिस आई मार्क दस करेक्ट एंड इवन आई डिड नॉट नो अबाउट एंटोलिया और अमहारा बट देन आई मार्क इट एज करेक्ट आंसर लाइक ओनली टू पेयर नाउ नाउ आई गो विद आई गो विद द um i'll go uh, uh, let's 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 move 89th question here we have a wild animals like how i how i, I did not know about this right but then uh, just see the appre- uh, third option here apprehension of a protected wild animals becoming a danger becoming a so coming to the 89th question uh this is a question where you should you know uh, you should go to the option third and you just see that what they are talking about apprehension of a protected wild animals becoming a danger to human life is sufficient ground for its capture or killing here you should see you know uh, the apprehension just just tumhe lagta hai ki ek apprehension that one animal will kill you uh and you know that is the sufficient ground for the capture or killing or killing bol raha hai if it is a capture tab bhi aap sochte but or killing matlab ye to galat hoga kyunki because we all talk we all talk, talk about you know animal life and saving animal life and everything saving nature so ye nahi hoga apprehend just because of apprehension you cannot kill someone even you know human life you cannot take a human life just because of apprehension right so this would be wrong so you will Uh, you will be left with the two options one two and two only मतलब दो तो सही है अब वन का ऑप्शन देखते हैं वाइल्ड एनिमल्स आर द सोल प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ गवर्नमेंट दिस आई थॉट यू नो इट्स 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 करेक्ट और यू नो हियर यू कैन गो विद द ऑप्शन वन टू और टू जो भी तुम्हें उस टाइम पे लग रहा है मुझे लगा ये वन टू और ये uh, मतलब फर्स्ट इज करेक्ट बिकॉज यू नो वी हैव डब्ल्यू पी ए वी हैव ई पी ए सो इट्स 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 अ गारंटी और इट्स इट्स अ रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी ऑफ द गवर्नमेंट सो यू कैन गो विद द ऑप्शन एज वन एंड टू नाउ दिस इज दिस इज अ दिस इज अ गुड क्वेश्चन हियर वी हैव अ सर्टन स्पीशीज ऑफ विच वन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग ऑर्गेनिज्म विल मेक द कल्टिवेटर्स ऑफ पंजाई सो वट वी कैन डू इज एंड एंड यू कैन गो विद द एंड ऑप्शन वाई यू कैन गो गो विद द एंड ऑप्शन until unless you don't know and you you might not know this kind of question right you nobody reads but cockroach crab spider these are like kind of useless things have you ever seen them you know cockroach doing some productive thing no right but ant ka hum bahut sari kahani sunte hain ki ant you know they build a community they you know they they complete that uh, huge task so ant you can go with the ant or otherwise if you do, if you are not sure about this you can just leave this question it's it's fine it's completely fine now uh, coming to the 91 question this is a good question this is direct question from the rs sharma when i talk about ncrt so you know this is very important ncrt and uh, some people were asking you know please share the list of important ncrt i will i will do share that list of ncrt in probably in a in a video or in a comment section i'll i'll share those एन सी आर टी लिस्ट बिकॉज दिस इफ यू सी धौली जगूड़ा ये सारे दिए हुए हैं एज इट इज ये दिए हुए हैं आर एस शर्मा में दिस इज फ्रॉम द उड़ीसा दिस दे हैव गिवन एज इन करेक्ट क्योंकि यू नो दैट ऑल्सो वर्क लाइक फोर ऑप्शन में हमारे फोर ऑप्शन सही होना इज वेरी लीस्ट लाइकली पॉसिबल ओनली वन सही होना इज लीस्ट लाइकली पॉसिबल विल लेफ्ट विथ टू और द थ्री ऑप्शन हियर ऑल्सो यू विल गो विद द गट फीलिंग ओनली टू पेयर वुड बी करेक्ट क्योंकि फोर में टू की प्रॉबिलिटी ज्यादा होगी एंड यू एंड ऑब्वियसली यू एंड यू ऑल्सो यू शुड बी नोइंग अबाउट धौली जगूड़ा इरागुड्डी कलसी ये हमारा दिया हुआ है दीज ऑल आर फ्रॉम द एम्पायर्स दैट वी रीड इन द एंशंट इंडिया now coming to the next question we have okay this is again this kind of question and you know you you might not know like na the right answer for this but at least you can what you can do is at least you can eliminate only one and all four because you know four mein two ki probability zyada hogi rather than four and rather than one uh, also this empire they have been asking previously previous year in 2021 they have asked about the yadav डायनेस्टी दे हैव आस्ट अबाउट द प्री मिडिवल डायनेस्टी राष्ट्रकुटा एंड पाला दे हैव आस्ट अबाउट इट सो यू शुड बी वॉट वॉट यू शुड बी डूइंग यू शुड बी एटलीस्ट नोइंग द फाउंडर फाउंडर ऑफ अ 
एम्पायर एंड एटलीस्ट यू शुड बी नोइंग द इम्पॉर्टेंट किंग फॉर एग्जाम्पल भोजा ने कुछ कराया है ये बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट थे या फिर समुद्र गुप्ता ने कुछ कराया है तो दीज दे आर इम्पॉर्टेंट किंग दे आर इम्पॉर्टेंट रूलर्स सो यू शुड बी नोइंग अबाउट देम एट लीस्ट लिटिल बिट एंड इवन इफ यू डोंट नो यू कैन गो विद द विद द ऑप्शन ट्रिक ऑल्सो एंड एट लीस्ट नाउ फॉर नाउ ऑन यू कैन यू कैन जस्ट रीड एंड लुक एट दीज एम्पायर्स Now ninety three question. This is a this is a very good question. You don't require any knowledge for this. Let's let's just read the option. Sangam poems are devoid of any reference to material culture. तो ये devoid of any reference. कोई भी reference नहीं होगा material culture का. ऐसा तो this is not possible. मतलब material culture they they would have talked about material culture, right? It is not possible. Now the social classification of varna was known to Sangam poets. This is a lenient option. This could be right, right? Social varna उनको पता था and संगम पोएम्स हैव नो रेफरेंस टू वॉरियर एथिक्स यार दिस कैन नॉट बी पॉसिबल बिकॉज ऑब्वियसली दिस इज अ संगम लिटरेचर इज ऑल अबाउट साउथ इंडियन लिटरेचर सो दे दे माइट हैव टॉक्ड अबाउट द वॉर दे माइट हैव टॉक्ड अबाउट द एम्पायर एंड एवरी थिंग राइट देर हैव बीन लॉट ऑफ एम्पायर्स एंड वॉर्स गोइंग ऑन सो इट्स नॉट लाइक यू नो दे माइट नॉट हैव गिवन एनी रेफरेंस ऑफ वॉरियर एथिक तो दिस कैन नॉट बी पॉसिबल दिस कैन नॉट बी पॉसिबल एंड संगम लिटरेचर रिफर्स टू द मैजिकल फोर्सेज इेशनल तो ये भी एक नेगेटिव कॉनोटेशन है कि आप मैजिकल uh, फोर्सेज को आप बोल रहे हो इेशनल है इवन मैजिकल फोर्सेज वी कैन नॉट टूडे ऑल्सो वी कैन नॉट से दैट इेशनल है ये दिस दिस एग्जिस्ट टूडे एज वेल तो आज भी मैजिकल यू नो फोर्सेज आर वी कैन वी कैन सी समवेयर बट वी कैन नॉट से दिस इज एज अ कंप्लीट इेशनल सो यू विल गो विद द मोस्ट प्रोबेबल आंसर एंड मोस्ट प्रोबेबल आंसर इज द सोशल क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ वर्ना वॉज नोन टू संगम पॉइंट दिस दिस यू कैन मार्क एज करेक्ट आई ऑल्सो डेट द सेम एंड आई गॉट इट करेक्ट Now yes, this is also good question. I have no idea about what yoga vasista is, but whenever you see an option of containing, you know, one second, whenever you see an option of Akbar, Ashoka, Krishna Devaraya, so these option you have to mark it as correct. ठीक है ये options अगर दिए हुए हैं तो ये हमें पता है कि ये सही होते हैं कहीं नॉर्थ ईस्ट का कोई ऑप्शन दिया है ये सारे ऑप्शन सही होते हैं कहीं अरुणाचल प्रदेश है ये सब ऑप्शन सही से होते हैं तो यहाँ पर मुझे नहीं पता योगा वशिष्ठा क्या है बट आई जस्ट मार्ग इट अकबर एंड आई कॉट इट करेक्ट नाउ दिस ऑप्शन या रामानुजा आई डिड नॉट हैव एनी आइडिया लेट्स लेट्स रीड सो विथ विथ गोइंग विद द ऑप्शन यू यू वुड रीच सेल्वे यू वुड रीच अप टू द ऑप्शन ए एंड अप टू द ऑप्शन डी आप ए और डी में बच जाओगे बिकॉज फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल दे टॉकिंग अबाउट सेल्वेशन दिस इज अ सिमिलर काइंड ऑफ ऑप्शन सेल्वेशन सेल्वेशन तो वी हैव टोल्ड यू अर्लियर इन द प्रोफेसर वीडियो इज लाइक सेल्वेशन इज अ यू नो सेल्वेशन सेम टाइप ऑफ सेम टाइप ऑफ आंसर इज देयर सो सेम टाइप ऑफ ऑप्शन में से ही कोई आंसर होगा नाउ वेदास आर इंटरनली ये ये जबरदस्ती यहाँ पर ऑप्शन घुसाए गए हैं तो इनको आप कट कर दो एंड ए और डी में इफ यू सी एंड इफ यू रीड द बेस्ट मीन्स ऑफ सेल्वेशन वॉज डिवोशन सेल्वेशन वॉज टू बी ऑप्टेन थ्रू मेडिटेशन सो एटलीस्ट यू विल You will reach up to fifty fifty, and here you can go with the short and sweet answer. Like the best means of salvation was devotion. Could, they, he could have said this, so this could be a you know right answer. Here oh, again, you have to just use your common logic with your uh, with your logical guessing. You you can reach up to the correct answer. Now coming to this question, the prime minister has you know this this question is about Somnath Temple. I did not know about Somnath Temple. Let's let's see with the options what we can reach. Somnath Temple is one of the Jyotirlinga shrines. So, ये one of the है. One of the is kind of some of the. तो ये हो गए हमारे very lenient. You know, it could be Jyotirlinga shrine. I don't know about twelve Jyotirlinga shrines. I don't know about it. But it could be. It could be right. Now, a description of Somnath Temple was given by Al Biruni. अभी ये भी एक fact हो सकता है Al Biruni. But let's see. Let's read the third option. प्राण प्रतिष्ठा ऑफ सामना टेम्पल इंस्टॉलेशन ऑफ दिस वॉज डन बाई प्रेसिडेंट एस राधा कृष्ण हियर आई वॉट आई वॉट आई फेल्ट इन द एग्जामिनेशन वॉज लाइक एस राधा कृष्ण दिस कुड बी एनी प्रेसिडेंट ये किसी भी प्रेसिडेंट ने कभी भी ये किया होगा आई डोंट नो दिस कुड बी अ फैक्ट राइट दिस कुड ऑल्सो बी फैक्ट बट बट अल बरूनी वॉज देयर इन द प्री मिडिवल टाइम्स मिडिवल टाइम्स में अल बरूनी हैज रिटन अ लॉट ऑफ बुक्स ऑन यू नो इंडिया सो सो अ डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ सोमनाथ एक सिर्फ डिस्क्रिप्शन दिया हो सकता है कि अल बरूनी ने दिया होगा दिस कुड बी राइट रेदर देन चेंज Changing this fact is easy. So S Radha Krishnan के जगह कोई भी n number of president हो सकता है, right? So this I mark it as incorrect and I'll go with the option as one two and this is how you have to go about it. And two facts दिए हैं तो obviously एक fact गलत होगा, right? So 
coming to the next question we have which one of the following statement best describe the role of b cell t cell this this is a good question we have you know vaccine uh, and covid going on from past 2 to 3 years so vaccination ke bare mein apne padha hoga b cell t cell is a very common thing you you would have read about it you know basic biology thing so we we uh, actually we you know we read about it that b cell t cell is there or and there is a beautiful option is there the act as immuno suppressants in the body so it this is basically uh, Uh, this is this helps in building this this will not you know fight the flu but this will help building the immunity in your body so this is how you can solve this question again coming to the next question we have uh, now uh, now just read the option other than those made by humans that nanoparticles do not exist uh, why it does not exist because nanoparticles could be biological also right it 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 could be from the nature there is no problem so do not exist ek no not wale connotation wale galat ho sakte hain because एक इतना स्पेसिफिकली बोलना माइट नॉट बी पॉसिबल यू नो दे माइट बी दे माइट बी अ बायोलॉजिकल नैनो पार्टिकल सो ये अगर गलत होता है तो वन वन में पहले कर दूंगी आई हैव अ लेफ्ट ऑप्शन विद अ थ्री एंड टू थ्री मैं ऐसे एक्चुअली में एग्जाम में बना लेती हूँ एंड देन आई सॉल्व कि अब मेरे को क्या करना है थ्री एंड टू थ्री में इफ यू सी नैनो पार्टिकल्स ऑफ सम मेटालिक ऑक्साइड्स आर यूज इन द मैनुफेक्चर ऑफ सम कॉस्मेटिक इट इट कुड बी देयर एंड देन सम भी है सम भी है दो बार नैनो पार्टिकल्स ऑफ सम कमर्शियल प्रोडक्ट्स विच एंटर द एनवायरमेंटल ये भी यहाँ पर भी सम है तो इट कुड भी पॉसिबल द पॉसिबिलिटी इज देयर सो आई गो विद द ऑप्शन एज टू एंड थ्री नाउ कमिंग टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वी हैव अ डी एन ए बार कोडिंग हियर and now uh, for example uh, science and uh, tech mein i'll i i would have generally gone if yahan par option hota 1 2 3 hota option so i would have gone with a 1 2 3 because you know dna barcoding that can be a tool so ye kuch bhi kar sakta hai aisa hum generally science and tech mein mante hain but what we can do is ab yahan par 1 2 3 option nahi hai to we we can find out you know most probable option which is identify undesirable animal or plant material ab ye undesirable animal yahi to hum karte hain crispr cas9 mein क्रिस्पर क्रिस्पर कैस नाइन में हम यही करते हैं कि अनडिजायरेबल एनिमल वी फाइंड आउट तो वी कैन सी कि डीएनए बारकोडिंग से हम ये कर सकते हैं इसी इसीलिए हम वो करते हैं ना कि डीएनए जो होता है वी फाइंड आउट द कैंसर कैंसरियस सेल एंड देन वी वी टेक इट आउट एंड देन वी 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 फिक्स इट विद द डी एन ए बार कोडिंग सो वी कैन वी कैन डू दिस प्रॉब्लली थर्ड थर्ड वी कैन मार्क जो जिसमें थर्ड ऑप्शन नहीं है वी कैन कट इट नाउ वी हैव लेफ्ट ऑप्शन थ्री एंड टू एंड थ्री नाउ डिस्टिंगाइज अमंग स्पीशीज दैट लुक लाइक नाउ इट्स योर कॉल थ्री टू थ्री में आप क्या ले रहे हो बट यू हैव टू फाइंड आउट द यू हैव टू फाइंड आउट द मोस्ट पॉपुलर ऑप्शन हियर एस इज द एज ऑफ प्लांट एंड एनिमल दिस वी 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 डू इट फ्रॉम द कार्बन फुट प्रिंटिंग राइट दिस इज फ्रॉम द कार्बन फुट प्रिंटिंग ये हमने बचपन में सिक्स स्टैंडर्ड में पढ़ा है कि कार्बन फुट प्रिंटिंग क्या होती है ठीक है तो ये नहीं होगा ऑप्शन इससे आप एक को एक को भी काट सकते हो एंड यू हैव लेफ्ट विद द ऑप्शन थ्री एंड टू थ्री तो इनमें से आप एक ऑप्शन चूज कर सकते हो कि हम क्या क्या कर सकते हैं तो इन साइंस एंड टेक गो विद द मोस्ट आंसर लाइक मोस्ट नंबर ऑफ आंसर टू थ्री सही होगा कि हम डीएनए बार से क्या क्या ज्यादा से ज्यादा चीजें कर सकते हैं नाउ कमिंग टू द लास्ट क्वेश्चन ऑफ द डे दिस इज दिस इज असिड रेन क्वेश्चन दे हैव बीन आस्किंग अबाउट दिस मेनी टाइम्स सो वी नो दैट इज इट इज इट इज एन टू ओ एंड इट इज एस ओ टू सो वी नो दैट दिस इज नाइट्रोजन ऑक्साइड एंड सल्फर डाई ऑक्साइड ये इसी ये ही मेन कॉम्पोनेंट होता है एसिड रेन का वी नो दैट कार्बन इज ऑल्सो देयर बट कार्बन मोनो ऑक्साइड इज नॉट देयर तो दे ऑलवेज आस्क क्वेश्चन अबाउट द एक्सेप्शन तो यहाँ पर एन यू नो टू एंड फोर वाला ऑप्शन जो है आप करेक्ट कर दोगे एंड दिस दिस इज द एंड ऑफ द uh conversation we have now i just wanted to thank you guys for the love you have showed in previous videos and also keep watching and keep uh, keep supporting us and also you know there there are some many questions that people are asking the capf cds questions please discuss those questions so those will be part of mentorship program and thank you guys thank you for watching